Hi guys, Jacob here again. I've got the second beauty. Also, RX 6800 XT. 16 GB of RAM, but different manufacturer. My rig is set up <laughs> and ready for the next one. Okay, let's see what's inside. Ooh, nice. Boxes very well looking. There she is. <laughs> Ooh, this one has a CD or so. Mm. What's that? Tough games. <coughs> okay. There. Okay. Here she comes. Ooh. This one's big. <laughs> it's the tiny one. <clears throat> That's why it doesn't work. <laughs> All right, this one looks very nice too. Pretty the same, two connectors. Is there a switch here? No, no switch there. Looks cool. Okay, I'll hook it up and I'll be back. Pretty done. I don't know when do we need both of them because they are supplied from one cable anyway. But just in case, if put, I'm putting both of them. Later on, I'm gonna read about that. Is it necessary or not? This one isn't too good because it's insulating heat. The card gets very hot, but it's not gonna stay here for long. All right, let's give it a try. Bzz, bzz. No, no, it's okay. Ooh, this one's Transformers. <laughs> okay. It's alive. Did some reading in those things. The manual is brilliant. Watch out if you you should connect whatever. They don't say should you connect both or one. This is crap as always. It's already installed. Good. Probably Windows didn't notice graphic card change. Okay. Run as administrator. Remember about that to overclock. This one is noticed. System. Da, da, da. It's the GPU. Good looking. Asus. Good. All right, exactly the same setup as last time. With overclocking values. Straight away. Detecting is okay, blah blah blah. All right, these are the values. Connecting new job. How long did it build that? Four seconds, a bit longer, but okay. <coughs> um, is it auto tune already implemented? Uh, ETH config 45 so far. Okay, let's wait a bit so it gets auto tuned. 62.3, very good, very quick. It's still tuning. Then I'm gonna put the value in here and it's gonna be faster. <coughs> I thought I did it last time, but it's not saved. Okay, 62.8, very good, that's the same. Still tuning. Looking good. 
Look good at Rick. <laughs> 62.7 getting worse. A1. I wonder will it be possible to lower the GPU voltage through that. I run it through a different uh, rig, let's say just like simple minor net. I have also Mindstad and the bloody Hive OS, which I think is the, the worst one you can have. And it allowed me to re reduce the voltage to six, 680 or something like that, and it runs really nice. Now it's 150, so it's completely off the scale. But let's wait for the tuning. Is it tuned? Shit. Uh, start. Uh, yeah, it's tuned. A10088. So we can put 100. Uh, no, 088. Okay, so it's gonna be quicker next time. Alright, clock core. I'm gonna decrease that to 7. Mem clock is alright. This one is okay. Okay. Let's try again, because it seems that this is everything what you can get under the windows. I'll make another movie with the uh, parameters from my rig, with the second card, so we can directly see the difference between those two cards. Okay, stop, save, run again with those values straight away. <coughs> And with the lower voltage, under voltage. Let's see, under voltage. Uh, there it is, 700. 719. No, that's fun. Bloody hell. Yeah, that's the same. You can't change that. 37, just to wind up. So it, it seems that this is the limit in the windows. And we're getting 150 watts, so this is this is completely out of scale. Core 119. Right? I'll have a look for my other parameters and I'm gonna set them here. What I found the best for the other one. And I'll get back. Okay. I have the values, but they aren't much different than that so it's one two four zero and the memory clock is the maximum what we can get under windows so it doesn't matter what we're gonna put in here as it doesn't sorry as it doesn't doesn't change anything at all okay save break start again 60 to trip to hand so it's supposed to run on that. Mm, is it or not? Two, three. Oh. Seems that it's running on that. No, memory clock. There is some limitation. It's a strange thing. I don't know why. And the GPU power drum. The voltage is also high. There's nothing to to be proud of. 880. So to be honest, looking at this one and the, the other one, the Merc, the Merc is much better than this one. But we'll see how it behaves in the rig with the different values optimized the memory is the maximum oh I have the afterburner I think it doesn't make any difference but let's see in here yeah that's the ma maximum 2150 no matter what you're gonna put it's always the same nothing 
140 is the better one. Working, oh, something changed. It's 61.1 and it was 62. The clock is the same. What changed? Yeah, well, it needs some time to play with. So, I'll, oh, there it's coming up. So I'm gonna play with that for a while and then I'm gonna come back with the uh, comparison of those two cards. The Merc and the Asus. On Merc I had here 117. And here is 153, so pss, completely different, different shelf. All right, thanks guys for watching. See you soon.